Hello and welcome to Datazar. Today I'm going to show you how to quickly get started with your Datazar Connect website. So first thing you do, let's go to datazar.com and you can either go ahead and sign up or log in. We're, we've already signed up so we're going to go ahead and log into our account and this is going to take us to connect.datazar.com. So let me get my username and my password. Alrighty, so that's going to take us here. And the first thing we have is our, our interview guide right here. But let's go ahead, let's get rid of this, and let's go ahead and let's go full screen right here. And quickly, I'm just going to go ahead and click off of this for just a moment because we're going to complete it right here on complete business interview. So let's click off of that. Now we could confirm the email address. It's very easy to do. We're not going to take the time to do that today, but it just sends you a confirmation email. You click on it. It's super easy. So this is what we're going to do to quickly get started with our website is we're going to complete the business interview. So we're going to click here to complete. So my business name, we're going to do example business and let's do this address and we're going to do the zip code 90050 okay let me click off of that okay and we have our phone so we completed our name our address phone number and then we have this checked here use this information to help customers find your business this is actually going to show up on your website so there's going to be a map. It's going to have this. So make sure that this reads as you want it to show on the map. So let's go to next. And now we're going to go ahead and we're going to enter some social media. So if you have some links, such as a Facebook link, we're going to do our Datazar Corp Facebook. And then also we have, um, we have an Instagram link. Let me just grab it here real quick. And so let's go to Instagram and we're going to plug that right here. Okay, so we're going to do this one. And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to click Save Changes. And remember, when you fill these out, these are also going to show up as links on your website for your customers to go to. So let's go ahead and click Save Changes. And we completed the business interview. So the next thing that we want to do is go ahead and register our website. So let's go ahead and click here to register your domain. And AAA outdoor scenes let me do a search on that and that's there we could click register here and we could click register one more time we're not going to register it at the moment we're going to stop short of doing that however had we clicked on it it would take us to billing so when you get to billing it's going to ask you to add a credit card number so let's go ahead and add a number Okay, this would take just one second. Okay, oops. And let's get the month and the CVC and the zip code. Okay, we're going to add the card. And there it is. So we have our billing here and now we need to choose a plan. Now we could go with basic or pro. The basic includes 5,000 5, email cents per month or the pro does. The basic has 2,000 email cents per month. The main thing is on these plans the free plan doesn't include a custom domain name. So you want to sign up for basic or pro and the basic is $9.95 per month. The pro is $19.95 per month. It's a really great deal because it includes your domain your hosting, your renewals, it includes your secure SSL, it includes your email marketing, everything's included in that. So we're going to go ahead and choose basic. And done. So had we registered a domain, this would also say done here. But the one thing I want to show you is you go to website right up here. And these are the editing tools. And this is the website that we just created. Because every time you 
register an account even if you don't get your domain um, it does have a public pre preview URL so every new account comes with a public preview URL if we had registered our domain it would show right here but let's go ahead and look at the public preview URL and there it is we have our website already set up we have our contact information here that we entered in the business interview we have our Facebook here and we have our Instagram here okay so we have all that going on and um, so there's the website again and let's go ahead and let's go back to connect where we were okay so we're back to connect we clicked on website here. We just clicked on the public preview URL to look at our website. These are the editing tools for working on your website. If you want to make a new post, when you want to add a page, there's also some settings here. These are all the editing tools. Now, one thing, I, two things I want to show you. First of all, for the editing tools, click on the education button. When you click on the education button, it's going to show you how to start building your website as a featured video. There are some other videos here, too, that are loading right now. And then there's also a YouTube channel for additional videos. So a really good video to start with is how to start building your website. Make sure you watch that video, how to add a page or a post to your website with those editing tools I just showed you. Make sure you watch these two videos. They're very good. And then here you can click this is on education here you can click on manage accounts and this is this is the business interview that we completed so if you want to edit that if you want to edit the name or address or phone number on your website if you want to edit your Facebook link your Instagram link you can do that through the manage accounts so make sure you pay attention to the education button where it has the videos, the tutorial videos, the manage accounts, and the website button, which is the website builder, but it'll show all that under the education. So let's go ahead and go back to dashboard. And that's it. That's how to quick, quickly get started with your Datazar Connect website.